Hey everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to walk you through Poppy AI, how it works, what makes it special, and how you can start using it right away. Let's get into it. So Poppy AI is a visual workspace that blends multiple AI models and lets you work with videos, PDFs, voice notes, images, and text all in one canvas. Instead of forcing your ideas into a linear chat, it gives you a mind map style environment where you can connect content, see relationships, and let the AI generate insights from everything you upload. It's ideal for creators, researchers, marketers, or anyone who wants to organize, analyze, and generate content more efficiently. You can drag in competitor videos, articles, documents, voice recordings, and Poppy will help summarize, compare, and surface ideas based on all those inputs. It replaces the need to switch between multiple tools because everything is in one visual canvas. So first is basically log in into your account right here and it will automatically bring you to this dashboard. And from the get go, you will see all these templates right here. So let's say I'm going to go with this YouTube OS dashboard. So this one right here, and I'm just going to click on it. After that, it will preview the template right here. So you can just simply zoom in or zoom out using your scroll wheel. So just simply click on control on your keyboard. Then just simply use your scroll wheel to zoom in and zoom out. So that's basically the most easiest way to navigate through the zoom ins or the zoom controls. And you just simply need to click and drag on the background to basically move here on the, on the whiteboard. So basically this is the content of this template. So we have this strategist and also the other strategies right here, the titles and the thumbnails and also the script writing. So let's say you want to use this template, but of course you could just simply make something from scratch. But if you want to use this template, you simply need to click on use template right here and it will automatically create the board for you. So you simply need to wait for it. As you can see, we now have the copy of that template. And here on the left side is like the navigation panel or the menu. And we have some videos right here that we could check out. And here is the share part where we can send this to other people or through other users. So you could watch this video if you want. So, but for me, I'm just going to skip it first. I'm going to click on get started. And as you can see right here on the left side, this is basically where every setting that we have here on our board is. So we have the chat. So this is basically what we are going to use, or this is the most important part of our board. And we could also add social media content right here on the left side, as you can see, and also our Facebook ads right there. We could also make a voiceover and Poppy AI will automatically generate the captions or basically make a transcript. We also have the images section the text section, the annotation, the website, mind map, document, and the group section right here. You can basically group stuff. So as you can see right here, this tab is basically a group and you could also change the name if you want. But as you can see, if I click on this part, I could change the name just like that. Uh, I can delete the name and just edit it out however I see fit. So let's say I'm just going to name it test since I don't have anything in mind yet, but basically you can do that. If you want to delete it, just simply right click on it and click on delete, but you could also copy it if you want. But for me, I'm just going to delete it, but let's say I want to create my own. So I'm just going to go back and I'm going to click on new board right here and just wait for it to load. And as you can see, it has automatically generated the title, but that's like the default one. So I'm just going to name it test for now. And as you can see, we can now drag and drop files here and you could also copy and paste social media content right here. But let's say I want to paste videos from YouTube. So I'm just going to click on YouTube right here. And now I'm just going to go to YouTube to basically find a video. And here I've searched for YouTube titles that get views and we have tons of videos right here. So this is basically what was in the template earlier, but we are just going to focus on this part, which is the YouTube titles. So I'm just going to copy this link. So how to write a better YouTube title and get more views. I'm just going to click on this video, copy the link. And I'm going to go right here back on Poppy AI. I'm going to paste the link right here and click on add to board. And as you can see, it has been automatically added to our board just like that. And if you want to move it, just simply drag it out just like that. And I'm just going to add more videos so that we have more things to work on. So I'm going to go with this video right here and I'm just going to copy it again. You can just basically paste it right here just like that without clicking on the social media content right there and stuff since this is basically faster. 
just paste it right here directly on your board. And now I'm just going to move it just like that. And maybe I'll add two more. So yeah, I've added three more instead of two. And now we are going to use the group feature that I've said or I have shown earlier. So I'm going to click on group right here. Okay, click on G since that is the shortcut. And I'm going to name it YouTube title, just like on the template earlier. Just like so. Now what you want to do is basically organize your board right here. So I'm just going to place my YouTube title just like that. And I'm just going to move out everything so that it looks clean. Just like this. Now I'm just going to resize my YouTube title. Now I'm just going to put the videos right here on this part to basically organize everything. So maybe I'll just do it like this. I'll make it longer just like that. Now, as you can see, I am done listing them out just like that. Now, what you want to do is click on the chat right here. So this is basically it. So I'm just going to resize it and just simply click on this like circle icon here on the middle. Then connect it right here, just like that. You'll know it's connected when it has this broken lines right there. And if you want to disconnect something, you will see an X icon when you hover on the middle of the line, just like that. So now this is basically where the magic happens. So here is where we will put our prompt on this part right here. And you could also use a voice recording or a voiceover right here to say what you want to do. But for me, I'm going to go with this default or this given prompt right here, which is get key insights. So I'm going to click on that. And as you can see, it has automatically pasted it right here. And you just simply need to wait. So as you can see, this is the result of the prompt that we just made. And as you can see here at the bottom, you can also create a voiceover, copy and retry it. So it was pretty fast. So it just basically went through all of the videos and searched for the most important parts or the most important pointers to remember and summarize it all right here. We could also use another prompt, which is summarize. So let's try it. And just simply wait for it. So after a few seconds, it is now done. So this is basically the summarization of all the videos that we have right here. And we could also add images if you want. So if I click on image right here, you could upload images on your PC or you could also go to the internet and search for like an image and just simply paste it right here. Just like we did with the videos earlier. We could also add text. So I could add a text right here and put my insights or something. And if I click on the slash button right there, we can add headings. We could also add basic blocks like codes, numbered list, bullet list, and, or anything that you want. We could also add images right here inside of the text panel. We could also use websites right here. So if I click on this, this will pop up. I'm just going to zoom in so you can see it better. So this will pop up. And I have a website right here that I want to use. So I'm just going to copy the link, paste it right there. Click on add website. And just simply wait for it to basically finish uploading and stuff. Now, once that is done, just simply connect it here on our chat. And let's say I want to get something from the website. So I'm going to say, get the key insights. Just like that. And let's wait for Poppy to basically respond to us. So as you can see, it has automatically read out everything in the website as it said right here. So based on the website content from, from this vid website that we have right here about writing exciting YouTube titles, here are the key insights. So as you can see, it has listed everything right there. You could also basically add this to the group if you want. So you could have multiple or different elements here inside of a single group right here, just like that. You could also add images right here or text and also a voiceover. So you can basically do a lot of brainstorming, content writing, script writing, and a ton of other stuff right here inside of this board that we have. And you'll also notice this like piggy icon here on the top. This is basically the credits. So credits get used every time you chat with the AI. And the things that eat up your credits are generally most of the stuff you have connected to the chat, like videos, voice notes, or text. File uploads like documents, images, PDFs and also the message length and web searches and tool usage. So now let's check out the pricing right here. So we have the starter creator and power user. 
where the creator is the most popular one, which is best for creators. So you get tons of credits per month. And it also has everything in the starter plan right here. So the monthly plan is $99 per month, which is best for small creators. But if you really want to upgrade your workflow, I suggest to go with the creator plan right here. Or if you are a big time or viral creator, you can go with the power user right here, which has everything from the starter and creator and a bunch of other stuff right there. But if you haven't bought Poppy AI yet, feel free to use our affiliate link which will give you a $25 discount on your purchase. So these are the pricing options. So first one is $399 a year, which is basically the starting one. And next is the $757 a year, which will give you Poppy AI and the VIP Live dedicated support. And for the last one, which is $997, which is a one-time payment, and it will give you a lifetime access. So if you're interested, click the link in the description, claim your $25 discount, and start using Poppy AI today. And that's basically it for this video, guys. If you have found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss anything. And I'll see you on the next one.